Hey y'all, I just decided to hop on and do another kind of vloggy kind of video. So I just wanted to share an experience that I had today. Um, I'm part of a group called the Initiation Circle. And it's run by um, a girl named the Squamish Medium, um, is what she's known on Instagram. I will also take her in this, but I just wanted to talk to you all that this is where I've been kind of learning about myself and the that I have abilities where I that allows me to talk to spirits to spirit and this is a recent development for me so I just decided that I would document the, my experiences so today I connected with somebody's loved one for the seventh time <laughs> um since joining this group I joined it beginning as a tarot reader but then I kind of went through it and started discovering that I or being told that I had mediumship abilities so I just decided to do it one day and I've been doing it since um but today I, t I did a reading on a girl named Car Car Carrie and um I connected with her an uncle I'm not going to go into details about it but it's very interesting the way I experience communicating with spirit is like the instant I start talking about them I can feel like something's like entered the, the room um and they, they'll come on certain sides from myself the thing I'm noticing the most right now is a if it's a feminine energy they'll come more from my right hand side and then if it's a masculine they'll come more from my left hand side um and the best way the best way I could explain feeling spirit from what I am experiencing is just like when someone holds like their hand in front of your face, you can feel that something is there. And it's the same, it's the similar kind of feeling where you just know that there's something standing there, but it's not actually there. Um, it's like you, you feel them clairvoyantly and clairessently and clairknowing. And I, I, I get a lot of feeling when I'm feeling spirit. Um, and today it was interesting. So I talked, I connected with her, the person that she wanted me to connect with. And I discovered that he actually had a stroke. So when I, when he, when I asked how he passed on, he started making my head feel dizzy and like I started feeling really sick and he just did not feel good in the end and he's it's there wasn't anything to do with the heart but I was right about him having a stroke so I thought that was really interesting um and then also today too I decided to try with some an oracle deck that I had I have called spirit oracle and that's um and they're it's created by uh some of the lovely ladies named and their company is called Wing and Bell. Um, and it was really interesting that when I pulled them out, he, my body started vibrating because her, the person I was reading for, not, not the, not, not the girl, not the, um, but the spirit got really excited again. He, and he mentioned that he liked, um, using Ouija boards. So he's like, this, this is different. I've never used these, but it, the, the cards that got pulled out were, um, bang on for the girl that was I was reading for so I just wanted to share that experience I'm also experience I'm also learning that I also feel a lot of their personality and um I get a lot of what their emotions are so I just wanted to share that guys with you so um and what my experiences are. I'm just gonna, I decided that I'm gonna start documenting my experiences just because I'm starting off and just to see kind of where it leads me. Um, Carrie also connected with my, one of someone for myself too, and she was completely bang on and she was amazing as well. So <laughs> um, I just wanted to share that with you. I hope you guys have a good day. Bye.